Good morning, everyone. Trina here again with another Tuesday morning haul. I can't seem to stay away from this place, but, you know, when there are such good deals, what are you going to do? All right. Um, most of the stuff is crafty stuff, but I did get a few items that were like toy variety. So let me go ahead and get started. All right. First of all, I got this pocket pop set of frozen characters, Elsa, Anna, and Olaf. And this was $4.99. Comes in a nice little reusable tin. So got that for my granddaughter for Christmas. $4.99. You can see the original price. Cute, cute. <clears throat> and then for those Fallout fans, Fallout is a um, video game so that you know. So I got five different little dudes and these were $3.99, normally supposedly $9.99. Cute. And then Vault Boy Luck. And a Saltron. He glows in the dark. Cute. And Vault Boy Toughness. There's a shoe. And Vault Boy Pyromaniac. And that's it for those, but I got one of these large pops for Fallout. And this is a Vault Dweller female. And this is $4.99, supposedly. Normal price was $9.99. Super, super cute. Alright. Now, crafts. Ah! Let's dive in. Alright, so I got a little pack of tags. These are really super cute. I already had one pack of them. And I think there are six tags in here. But I think that there's um maybe a variety of designs. Yeah, a couple different designs in here. Grab the rest real quick. I don't know if you can pick up on those soft pink colors. And that one. So that is that little set of tags. And then another little set of tags. Oh, I guess I could just show the picture on the back, huh? This is from Amy Tangerine. Does it say, does it? Yeah, five tags. And there they are. All right. What was the other one? We are memory keepers. Okay. And then I was so excited about this. I got the large ones, larger ones in an Amazon haul, but these little Sizzix thinlets. 11 different dies. Let's see him back here. Very exciting. For $5.99, normal price is $12.99. Yep. And then, finally, I picked up a stamping platform. Now, it's not a Misty or anything like that. What is this? We Are Memory Keepers. It was $14.99. Normal price is supposed to be $34.99. I do have a teeny tiny one like this that has the little pegs in it that you press it down, but it's only about this big and it just wasn't enough. But this actually has the magnets and such with it. So <clears throat> the other one that I have works pretty nicely, actually. So I'm excited to try this one out and see how well it really works. So that is it, my little stamp press machine the machine I'm the machine anyway there's that and then I got a whole bunch of card stocks that I want to show you before I get over here to my crafters companion boxes so I think this is all basil card stock so I got this um wild pansy color it's three ninety nine eight and a half by eleven more eight and a half by eleven Basil. 
I really like the embossing that's done on there. So it's just like a craft card stock. Again, basil 25 sheets. And this is emerald green or emerald city, sorry, basil. $3.99. Oh, I got another one of those. Huh? <laughs> Didn't realize. I went to three different um, stores, by the way, so sometimes I forgot what I already got. Come on, focus. Sorry about the lack of focus. Red carpet. So that has a little bit of texture to it. That's pretty nice. Again, that's basil. And avocado. Same deal. Basil. And then I got this Crafter's Companion Pearl card stock. It says browns. So I don't know if that means there are a variety of browns or if it's just a brown. Let's look, shall we? Just real quick. Or not. It seems to be stuck in there. Maybe it's a pad. But really, it looks like it's all the same. <clears throat> Is the camera picking up? I think it is. That this is like a pearl card stock, and this was three ninety nine, and that is Crafter's Companion, and then I got this DCWV eight and a half by eleven acid free paper, and this is actually paper. One hundred eighty sheets for six ninety nine. Everyday essential stack, and again, not card stock, but paper. And it has repeating designs, but the colors change. And sometimes the, <clears throat> excuse me, the colors change subtly. But it's kind of nice to have all these different designs in various colors. I can't tell you how many times I've been working on a project and thought, gosh, if only I had that in X color. Now, I do have it in X color, and Y, and Z. Alright, and then I got some more of this color. I think it was the wild something. Anyway, but this was $4.99 because it is 12 by 12. More basil. And then I got two pads of this, which I think I might already have some, but... Anyway, I've been picking up all the frozen stuff because I have some things in mind for... Um, <clears throat> a couple of projects. So let's see. And these are 36 sheets. Looks like they're double sided. Yep. $9.99. Normal price, 30 bucks. Why? Why? Anyway. Alright, so do a quick flip through. Just a little bit. That's cute. All right, if I could get my fingers to work this morning, sorry. There's the back side of that one. That's another one of the same, another one of the same. And then there's this. So, oh, back. That's pretty. I'm blocking the light in the meantime, sorry. So it looks like there are three different designs. I mean, three of each design <clears throat> for a total of 12 different designs. And the other side of that. I don't know where my light went. I had my camera light on too and seems to have disappeared. And there's that one. On the back of it is this. Yeah, I think this is a completely different paper pad than the other ones that I have. And these silhouettes. These are really cute. And on the back of the silhouettes, this design. Snow it all. You can see those subtle little snowflakes in there. And on the back, that's really pretty. 
I like that. And then more silhouette type paper. Whoopsies. And this is actually, I mean, it's cardstock, but it's actually rather thin. And then more silhouette type paper. And on the back of that, that's fun. Sisters, and oh, that's a nice winterscape. I like that. And then that on the back. There's Olaf. Oops. And on the back of Olaf is that design. And then, sisters together. Why didn't we get one of the other sister by herself? That seems wrong. Unfair. And some leaves. So, I'm really happy about those paper pads. Super cute. Now, on to the Crafter's Companion. I love these. I got one already. Um, I showed it in a previous haul video. But these are pretty awesome. You get so much in the box. And whether or not I'm going to do the projects that they show, it's another story, but I'm just excited to have all the elements that are inside. So this has over 185 elements. <coughs> it says it makes a minimum of 18 cards mixed sizes. $12.99. I mean, when's the last time you were able to get paper alone to make 18 cards for 13 bucks? All right, so let's see what it says it comes with. It includes 10 stencils, 33 acrylic stamps, 5 pieces of watercolor card, 12 die-cut tags, 18 card blanks, 18 envelopes, 6 blank card, 63 folded, I mean foiled, sorry, my bad, die-cut toppers, and 24 colored cards. Let's dive inside this box and have a look. Oops. All right. You're welcome, as always. So, here are the watercolor tags. Focus, thank you. Little bitty tags, but you can see the texture on it. Watercolor paper. And the stamp set. Be your own sunshine, just a note, wishing you a beautiful day, and more. Lots of great little sentiments, flowers, butterfly, that's nice. Let's stick this over here. And then these are the card toppers that they're talking about, the foiled card toppers. It's nice that they left some blank here so that you could um, add your own stamping. Alright, let me see if I can get this out, or these out, just to have a look at them. So, I guess it's all the same shapes in different colors, and, oh, maybe not, different sentiments. There's some nice sentiments in here. I really like all the blank pieces. And pink, nice variety of colors there. Right. And then all the stencils. How many stencils did I say? I don't even remember. A lot. So we'll have a look at the stencils. It's nice they're packaged together, but then they're each individually packaged as well. So we'll have a look at those. So we have all these florals here. Hmm. This is nice. Makes me think of stained glass or mosaic or something. And then these flowers and leaves. Hearts. Hmm. Oh, I like this. Sort of a damask. I don't know if I'm using that word correctly. <laughs> oh well. Anyway, there's that. And then the star pattern. 
looks like stars and chains. And then we got some circles. They're not perfectly round. There we go. And then this um, honeycomb sort of texture. And I don't know if it you can tell, but they're not perfectly cut. I mean, I know that was done by design, but I kind of like the um, imperfect look that's there. And then this floral. Come on, there we go. And some more circles, and these are actually circle circles. And this little floral pattern. That's nice. Alright, and then as was mentioned, envelopes, cards, and here's our watercolor paper. Might focus, there we go. It looks like all these papers look to me like they're <clears throat> what, eight by eight, six by six, eight by eight. Yeah. And here is some colored card. You can see a variety of colors in there. And then some black card. And that is that particular box, but no doubt, certainly worth the $12.99 that I paid, and, you know, probably worth the original price, which was, what, $24.99, $29.99, I'm not sure, you know what, I'll just slide those back in there like that, and deal with all that later. Anyway, again, you're welcome. And that one is called the Stencil Craft Kit. I forgot to mention, sorry. So this says normal price is $29.99. I think I saw some online the other day that you could get um, maybe at scrapbook.com or I don't know, wherever it was. They were, I want to say like around $24, $25. Alright, so this one, sorry. Again, this one was $12.99. This is called Build a Scene. And look at that. Aren't those cute? I'm so excited about this particular pack. And this has 14 metal dies, 23 clear stamps, 29 card blanks, 19 envelopes, 12 printed paper sheets, 12 pieces of black and white card, 9 pieces of ribbon, and 12 pieces of colored card. This says it makes a minimum of 19 cards. And same thing, $12.99. Normally, whoops, sorry. Hello, focus. $29.99. I guess that's not important. You can just take my word for it. You're welcome again. Hooray. Oh my gosh, you guys. Look at this. So super cute. Metal dies. I love this so much. I've always wanted something that was kind of fairyland-ish. Oh, I love that. Love, 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 love. <clears throat> and then a stamp set to go with it. That is just precious. Have a magical birthday with love once upon a time. Oh my god. Just gorgeous. Just gorgeous. And then we have some ribbon. It's three different colors and three different sizes. It's a pink, a blue, and a cream. And then all of our card blanks. Oh, that's cute. They included, looks like they have some normal size cards back there. I say normal, you know what I mean five and a half by four and a quarter, but then we have four by fours and five by fives, so that's fun. These sizes I don't normally run across or normally use, so it'll be fun to use those, especially considering, you know, the, the dies are designed, I guess, or laid out to do, like, square cards, and here are the envelopes. Oh, wait, 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 okay. So you got your A2, what is that, A7, and then those must be 6x6 six six cards back there. 
Oh, and look how they fold. No, they're not six by six. They're just not folded? Or are they? Okay, I'm sorry, you guys, but I have to take one of those out because now I'm all confused. Oh, okay. So you could bend that and do a special fold card. Ah, love it, love it, love it. That's awesome. That's so awesome. Okay. And, again, back to the envelopes. And then the black and white card. Colored card. <clears throat> so it looks like there are blues, browns, and greens in here. Oh, that's pretty. The printed paper. Just a variety of designs in here. Oh, and that actually has a thing in the back, like an instruction sheet. I haven't really seen that in any of the other ones. Oh, showing you how to make the part that pops up, I guess, when you fold the card so that part stands up. Nice. out a couple of these pages real quick just to, if I can. Sometimes the static is just too much. Nice pastels. So they're all like watercolor looking pastels. Nice. Very exciting. All right, and I have one box left. So those of you who are still with me, thank you. Bear with me. Let me get these put in this box and we will Move forward. Alright. And next we have Everyday Cards Craft Kit. Again, $12.99. This says it has over 400 elements. Okay. This includes 8 metal dies, 20 die cut card blanks, 20 envelopes, 42 die cut sentiments, 24 pieces of printed paper, 24 pieces of colored card pack, 60 buttons, 100 gems, 100 pearls, 9 pieces of ribbon, and 1 piece of twine. Alright, let's just um, look at that real quick so you can see the designs. And let's just get into it. <clears throat> they just wrapped so prettily, aren't they? Alright, so buttons. I love how they label the bag, just in case you didn't know. These are buttons. And then we have, oh, that's nice, the gems, assorted gems and assorted pearls in coordinating colors with the buttons and the ribbons. So the ribbons, looks like we have three colors, three sizes of three colors. Aww. Look at these dies. Two different flags, two different of those. Pretty, pretty. That's nice because you could make a frame if you wanted to. I really like that corner. I mean, you don't have to use it in a corner, but this edge die. The flowers. Oh, I see. So you cut out the flowers and then you can put a button in the middle of them. Mm hmm. <clears throat> Here's the twine. It's kind of really soft pink, just in case Baker's twine, in case you can't tell on the camera. Soft pink. And then card blanks. Look at that. They have, um, these are die cut card blanks. Sorry, let's just pull a couple out so that has pennants on it. So I guess you could die cut and then put colors over the top and then huh so a lot of these co um, coordinate with the dies that's kind of neat that way you can punch out your different colors oh, 
There's that one and that one. You can see it through the plastic. Nice. It's kind of interesting. And then we have envelopes to go with. And then these are die cut sentiment sheets. So it looks like there are two that are the same, maybe three. You can see all the different sentiments that you can use. And the nice thing about these is you can color them. I mean, they're, come on, focus. They're white, so it leaves it up to you to decide what you want to do with them. And of course, you could leave them white. So let's see. Here are our card sheets, coordinating pastel colors. And we have the printed paper. I want to see if this is paper paper or like hard stock. Alright, so it's not hard stock, but it's a very heavyweight paper. Can you hear that? <clears throat> Almost like the thickness of maybe wallpaper. So I'll just quickly go through these. I don't see any repeats yet. I realize I'm skipping some, but just wanted to do that kind of quickly. At the risk of making anyone dizzy. Oh my goodness. Those are super cute. All right, everybody. Thanks again for tuning in and making it to the end. I really appreciate it. If you like this video and would like to see more, I do have two other Tuesday morning haul videos on my channel. And they are pretty recent within the last couple of weeks. And I do try to post a couple of times a week. I do haul videos, flip throughs of projects I've done. I have recently revamped my channel, so I'm trying to get more on there in terms of actual, you know, not tutorials or craft alongs, whatever. But anyway, if you liked what you saw and you'd like to see more, please consider subscribing. Click on these other videos. If you subscribe, hit that bell notification down there. Also, I'd appreciate it if you'd go down to the bottom and click on some of those links in the descriptions if you'd like to see some of this stuff at Michael's just in case you don't have it at your Tuesday morning and you'd still like to get your hands on some of it. Those are affiliate links and at no extra cost to you. It does help me out quite a bit. Uh, well, it's minimal, but I'll take it because in these times we can all use all the help we can get, right? Anyway, I really appreciate your time. Thank you so much for joining my channel again. Don't forget to subscribe, click on the bell for notifications, and watch some of these other videos down here. Thanks again. Have a happy, happy, happy Christmas. Bye-bye.